Mancandy's control armature has 90 controls among 269 total bones, 9 curves, 17 lattices, and 49 empties, augmented by IKFK controls comprised of 4 objects and an action. Most of these elements are hidden to make life simpler for animators. The armature Candy Scale has controls on layers 1 through 10. Each layer controls one part or function of Man Candy's body. FK controls for the arms are on layers 3 and 6 for the left and right arm. Bones can be rotated and scaled. In addition, the balls can be used to bend the arms and shear the hands for extreme animations. Arm IK controls are on layers 4 and 7 for the left and right arm. The bend and shear controls are available in IK as well as FK. The arms can stretch as much as you like. IKFK blending is a special case of animated constraints. To make things simpler, the action McDriven contains driven channels that let you use the objects IKFK.R and IKFK.L as blending drivers. You should either duplicate McDriven to start new actions, or keep a McDriven strip on the NLA. Layer 5 and 8 have left and right finger controls, just one bone per digit, 8 in total. Rotate the bone to rotate the finger or thumb. Scale the bone to curl the digit. Slick digits, man. Layer 2 has leg controls. Feet are in IK with a pivot at the heel and another in the midfoot. The legs can stretch, like the arms. The little arrowed curves control knee direction, while the balls allow direct control of the knees and bending of the legs. Man Candy has two layers of facial controls. Layer 9 has the shape key drivers from Mancandy 
and layer 10 has new controls that influence lattices and shape keys. Animate with layer 10 controls for broad and smooth motion. Use the layer 9 controls to refine and enhance your poses. Layer 1 controls allow posing of head, neck, and torso. Bones with a squarish outline indicate that you can move and also rotate them. Head rotation is independent of the torso for ease of posing. 